could remember author's names, so it would make these videos so much easier. What is English? We are like 30 seconds into this video and I'm already not being able to speak, so I'll take a shot for every time JN says. I'm very excited for this one because y'all gonna be drunk as heck. Just saying. You're welcome. <laughs> and today I'm here with my most anticipated reads for March 2018. I have a total of six books. I tried to pick books that aren't super talked about and well known so hopefully you guys can find something that you like because we don't want to hear about the same seven books in every single video. So without further ado, let us get started. <sighs> The first book that I am anticipating is called Silent Victim and it is by Caroline Mitchell and this is supposed to be released March 1st, 2018. It follows Emma who has been hiding a very big secret for most of her life. She's actually hiding the body of the teacher who tried to seduce her as a teen in her back garden. Her husband Alex recently got a promotion so they are moving to a bigger house with their son and that's when Emma decides that she needs to get rid of the body. So she goes out to her garden and she digs up the shallow grave only to discover that the body isn't there anymore. So in a panic she tells her husband and he starts to unravel all these secrets he didn't know about her. It just sounds so good right up my alley. I just want to know like about the other secrets and what the heck this lady is all about. So I'm very excited for this one. Next book I am anticipating is called Sometimes I Lie and it's by Alice Feeney. This is supposed to be released March 13th and I'm just going to read you what the back of the book says because I think it like sums it up really well. My name is Amber Reynolds. There are three things you should know about me. One, I'm in a coma. Two, my husband doesn't love me anymore. And three, sometimes I lie. And like I am hooked already. Like I just need to know what the heck that whole thing is about. It sounds so interesting and I am just fully intrigued so I need it. The next book I'm anticipating is called The Flight Attendant. This is by Chris Bojalin. I'm probably saying that wrong but it is supposed to be released on March 13th 2018 as well. The book follows Cassandra Bowden and she's a flight attendant. She also has a drinking problem and then one night she is in Dubai on a layover and she only has a couple of hours to get to the meeting place to get to her next flight. And that is when she notices the man beside her in her hotel room is lying in a pool of blood and she has no recollection of what happened the night before. She ends up leaving him in the hotel room because she doesn't remember what happened the night before and she doesn't know if she was the one who murdered him or not. That's when she is met at the gates in New York City by the FBI and they start asking questions. I just want to know if she's a murderer or not, honestly. It definitely sounds like she's going to be an unreliable narrator, and I personally love unreliable narrators, so I'm very excited to get my hands on this. Okay, so the next one. I honestly have no idea if I think this is funny or if I'm actually interested in this book. The book is called Long Shot, and it is a basketball romance by Kennedy Ryan. It is supposed to be released March 22nd, 2018, and honestly, it just says that it's a forbidden romance with an NBA player. You know, my life goal is to marry an NBA player, so I just want to read it so I can live vicariously through this lady, okay? Those are my reasonings, and I have no shame in admitting it. Next book is called Exhibit Alexandra, and it is by Natasha Bell, and it is supposed to be released on March 13th, 2018. It follows a woman named Alexandra Southwood who has been missing, and she is being held against her will in this room. Her kidnappers are constantly torturing her with news clips of her husband, Mark, pleading to the public for the search of Alexandra. That's when her bloody belongings are found by the side of the river and her kidnapping case turns into a murder investigation and it's basically Mark going on this journey trying to figure out what happened to Alexandra and it just sounds like another suspense thriller and you know you girl is all about suspense thrillers so I'm very excited to pick this one. The final book that I have is called They All Fall Down. This is by Tammy Cohen and it is supposed to be released on March 6, 2018. This book follows a woman named Hannah who was recently admitted into the high-risk psychiatric unit. Two deaths have already occurred since she was admitted, one of them being her best friend Charlie. Since the unit is high-risk, the doctors are all saying that it was a suicide. Hannah was best friends with Charlie and she knows that Charlie would never have killed herself, so she begins to believe that there is a serial killer inside the unit 
unit who is trying to pick off the patients one by one. Hannah's mom, Corrine, is worried about Hannah. She's a bit skeptical about Hannah's beliefs about the serial killer and she thinks that it's probably due to her psychological illness why she's thinking this way. She then discovers a bunch of inconsistencies about the director of the unit named Dr. Roberts and she begins to believe that Hannah might be right. This just sounds like another psychological thriller and again, your girl loves psychological thrillers so I'm excited for this one. Take another shot. All right guys, so that was my most anticipated releases for March 2018. Hopefully you found some that sounded interesting to you and I will see you all in my next video. Goodbye.